Well, good afternoon, everyone. Welcome to Manchester, which is probably our last bubble, our last behind closed door event as we come through the pandemic, of course, incredible night in Texas with Canelo against Billy Joe Saunders last Saturday. 73,000 people there. No people in Manchester Arena. We're about to go to the main press comment shortly, but we're here firstly for the new announcement of our latest signing, someone we're very, very pleased to welcome to the team, uh, a young female fighter who I've watched for many, many years, Sandy Ryan. Sandy, welcome to the team. Outstanding talent, Commonwealth Games gold medalist, GB podium squad, and even before we were in women's boxing, someone I looked at and felt like would be a huge star in the programme. Shout out as well to Paul Reedy and Sean O'Toole, STN Sports. They know talent when they see it. Sandy, welcome to the team. Turning pro, ready to go. And like I said, all those years ago, I think when we first met, women's boxing, female boxing was, was hardly in existence in the UK. Now, what a time to be entering. Yeah, it was a few years ago, wasn't it? And um, I'm just so excited. Thank you for uh, believing in my ability. And uh, I just can't wait to show like the world what I'm capable of. I've had like nine years on GB. I'm bringing all the experience. And the people, the girls that bring the most experience, that right now they're at the top of the game in the pro game. So I feel like I can, I can reach that and uh, I'm, I'm ready to go. Ready to Obviously, go. you're one of the original crew, really, and from the female side of the GB, been there a long time from a very young age. Yeah. Amazing opportunities there and platforms. The ability to travel around the world in, in big international tournaments, giving you great experience as well. Yeah. Um, I've been all over the world um, for the past nine years. I've boxed all styles. I've been in the ring like, with all styles. So I'll be ready to fight anybody, uh, anybody. Um, like, I don't really need much warm-up fights. Just, yeah, put me in there. <laughs> Obviously, starting off in the super lightweight division and, and a fantastic division as well. Chantel Cameron is a world champion there as well. You've got Callie Reese, you've got Mary McGee, you've got Christina Leonard too as well, who we're actually trying to get some kind of unification uh, tournament yeah. together for those girls. The division below, of course, run by Katie Taylor. Yeah. Terry Harper, who I see moving up through the, the, the weight classes. Natasha Jonas, who I think can fight anywhere between 130 and 140. And even as you go up through the divisions, which I guess is inevitable over the next few years, you know, the likes of even Clarissa Shields up, you know, at 154, etc. But yeah. so many fighters now, so many household names that could be opponents of yours over the next few years. Yeah, there's so many fights that can be made. Um, and I'm floating around the weights that are a big fight. So, yeah, um, bring it on, bring it on. I'm ready to bring it to the pro game. How's that been for you to watch that development of, of women's boxing? Of course, led by Katie Taylor, but the other names I mentioned, so many great fighters. Savannah Marshall, who was obviously a teammate of yours as well at the GB squad. Must have been at times sitting there in the GB squad going, you know, I can do this, I can be a part of this. And you couldn't have come along at a better time. <laughs> yeah, so many times. Um, I've watched them like throughout the years and as I've been training throughout the GB, thinking my time's going to come, my time's going to come. And I, I believe like this is the, the best time. Um, the platform's there and I just want to make it even bigger. Um, and I believe I can with my, my ability. Obviously, very well known around Derby. We talk about, you know, the potential for you there. It hasn't been a, a city over the years that has produced endless talent and endless draws in boxing. Of course, yeah. your brother had a great run as well in some big title fights as well. But a big opportunity for you in that city to bring world championship boxing to Derby. Yeah, um, Derby's great. Like They support they support their own. And I've got a lot of Derby support behind me. So, yeah, you, if you want to make that fight at Pride Park, <laughs> I'm sure we can feel that. <laughs> and finally, where do you see yourself and how do you see yourself moving? I know, you know your team, Clifton and, and Paul... We'll be looking at how to progress you, but how quickly do you see yourself moving? And what is the, the dream for you? I mean, I know you've talked about becoming a multi-weight world champion. It's not even just about becoming a world champion. That's really setting yourself some major targets. Yeah, I, I'm set, I've set myself some high standards. Um, and yeah, I'm, I'm going to be your next su female superstar. Yeah, good. Well, we look forward to it. I <laughs> believe in you. And we cannot wait for the journey of Sandy Ryan to get underway. She will be fighting at Fight Camp this summer. A huge stage will be set there for her professional debut. And moving forward into big world title fights for Derby for the UK, another female star has entered the huge, thriving world of female boxing. And we can't wait.